My lab is interested in figuring out the rationales and reasons behind protein levels in the cell and why they're regulated in the way they are. A major achievement of modern biology is that we know a lot about how these molecules work. We know a lot about protein structures and how they perform their functions, but that's not enough to make a good cell. To make a good cell, you need to have the right amount of ingredients. And we know almost nothing about what makes a amount of protein optimal for the cell. And I like to use the analogy of baking as an example. Imagine I give you a recipe with only ingredients. You would have no idea of how to make a bake a very good cake out of that because I, have, I don't tell you about the quantities of each of the ingredient. And as a scientist, I'm really interested in figuring out how evolution has optimized these ingredients to make a good soup of cell. I came from a physicist background and I always like to play with numbers. So I take advantage of the sequence information that are available for all of the bacteria that we work with and we develop new techniques on the wet lab side to measure protein synthesis rates and measure the type of transcripts they make from the genome. And we developed computational tools to analyze this new kind of data. And we also develop mathematical models to understand why these RNA and proteins are made the way they are. And then we go back into the lab and test these predictions. The types of questions that we're trying to answer are fundamental to our human beings. I have a five-year-old son and a two-year-old son, and they, the question they ask all the time is why, daddy, why, right? And in biology, we don't ask this kind of question very often. We try to ask the question of how do things work, how does this protein carry out the particular function? And especially nowadays, we can really already define what's in the cell to a very high precision. It's a good time that we start to ask the why question and, and at a quantitative level. My goal to build a lab is to attract people from all kinds of disciplines and we really benefit from learning each, from each other. What is unique about what we do is that we really try to have every student, every project have a connection between the experimental side and the computational or mathematical side and ask fundamental questions that can be only addressed by a close interplay between these, these two disciplines. This is one of the best jobs out there. I get to interact with so many good students. I watch them grow up and we all grow up together. I can see the next generation scientists being um, trained and developed uh, in, in, through this program.